Hi guys, uh, Rick Malava. My nickname in the forums is uh, CTP Ram here with uh, a little video answer to a question that came up in the forums from a user named C Naughty. Um, what he's asking for is he uh, he well I'll just read it here. I need to boolean. I need a boolean that will delete the shared space of two objects. So I've got object A and object B when they are put together without deleting one of the objects. So it looks like so say I have a two unit thick pipe, object A, that intersects with a cube, object B, and I want the space that these two objects share at the intersection to disappear. That's a Boolean difference. So you want to basically subtract the pipe from the cube where they intersect, if I'm reading your post correctly. So I have here a pipe and a cube, and so I want to subtract A from B, so it's B minus A, so you select the cube minus the pipe, so you select the pipe next. The order is is significant here. And then you can just come down and do a Boolean difference. And that is the space that both the cube and the and the pipe shared are deleted. Now I think Dave was thinking you wanted to combine two pipes together and subtract them from the cube. And you can do that too. Let me first delete this and then show you the other operation you can do with a Boolean. You can do a Boolean union, of course, and that combines the two objects. And you can see that they're now combined. If I go to wireframe, there's no cube inside that you can see, or no pipe that was inside the cube that you can see. If I roll back to before, oh, here's another one of these fun things that happens. Oh, here we go. One second, never mind. Uh, here's a, I had a pipe, I made a second pipe. Uh, oh, these are combined right now, let me uh, separate them. Let me separate them, there we go. So now you see we've got two pipes here. So I initially thought it was the same thing that Dave was trying to do, uh, say, and if you actually take these two pipes and combine them, like this and do a uh, a combine so now they're a single object if I pick them you can see they they move up and down they're combined uh, and I try to delete them from this cube so I want to once again make this A and this B and if I want to go B minus A and I come down here into a boolean you're going to see that difference that both everything disappears because we're breaking some rules for uh, what you can do with when you boolean objects. Now, the way you can do this if you want, you're close. Instead of combining them, uh, let's just uh, uh, separate these guys out. And uh, instead of combining them, let's pick the these two guys and uh, let's isolate them for now. And uh, so let's actually start out by taking these two objects into a union, boolean union. Boom. Now they disappeared because I had them isolated and it created a new object here. So see, there's the two pipes are now combined. And now with the two pipes uh, Boolean unioned together, uh, let's delete their history and then let's take the cube and the two combined pipes and now we'll do a Boolean difference. And boom, you get some really crazy gnarly shapes. So <laughs> two pipes combined together and then subtracted from the cube. So the other operations that you can do, let me separate these guys again, let's hide this guy, is of course, uh, I showed you the union, the other one is I can take the uh, uh, the cube and the, and the pipe, and in this case the order doesn't matter, but we can actually just leave the intersection of the two objects by going Boolean intersection. Oop. Let's try that again. Boolean intersection. Okay, I must have mouse must have slipped off the uh, the object there. But there's the intersection of the two objects. So there you go. I showed you the union, the difference, uh, and the intersection, and ways that you can combine objects together into sort of a master object, and then uh, and then boolean difference them out of the cube. So I hope this helps you out. I'm not sure I was interpreting your question right, but I I hope this is uh, gets you a little bit closer to what you're trying to figure out. Uh, this has been CTB Ram with SimplyMy.com, and uh, uh, good luck with your modeling.